I'm Kenny from Pro Tool Reviews. I've got Greenworks Next Generation 60 Volt Pro String Trimmer with me today. It's a 16 inch model. There's a, a few things going on here that are worth noting. Starting at the top, uh, notice the battery placement. So we are now just straight up through the top, clicks in place and makes us ready to go. So I also noticed when I'm picking this up, this is pretty light and well balanced considering the size of the battery that goes in here. So I like that as soon as I pick it up, I've already adjusted the handle some uh, to my height. And, uh, and I like it. it doesn't feel like it's putting some strain on my lower back. In fact, when you do need to adjust that handle, it's really simple. Just a knob right here that you can unscrew or tighten down. So even if you want to move the handle to the side, if you like to edge with your string trimmer, you can do that too. Controls are very simple. Here's a safety, trigger safety here. So you're going to activate it as soon as you put your hand down on top. And then you've got the actual trigger here. So on the business end, notice that we've got our motor mounted on the front. And again, this is a 16 inch model. And if you want to go for more runtime, you can just turn this cutter head. We've got it in the longer position. Just take these two screws out, flip it to the other side. You get some more runtime out of there. And this is a 080 line that they pack it with which is absolutely fine for your residential needs. Now, if you're getting into some thicker stuff, you might want to try some 095. You're going to reduce your runtime some with that, but this is fine for what we've got. There's also some cool stuff going on here we'll show you in a second. Now, you got two speeds on this. So in your first speed, lower speed, you're going to get better runtime, but not as much power. So take a look at that. And it does fine on this kind of stuff. And if you want to flip it into a higher power mode, uh, just switch it over to two. It's very, very easy. And uh, so it clears that grass a lot faster and with more power. In fact, they're telling us in high speed that they're getting the equivalent of a 25cc gas engine power out of it, which is pretty cool. So that makes it a full gas replacement for residential use. Now, what I wanted to show you up here is uh, Greenworks load and go system on the head. So it's, uh, I'm gonna try to do this on the fly and that always carries with it uh, some danger of messing it up, but we'll see. So uh, when it comes time to actually change the line on the trimmer, you don't have to go through all of this mess. Okay? You don't have to take it all apart and that. I'm only doing that be so that I can uh, get the line out. Now what you do, is you've got a couple of indicators here. So there's an arrow here and there's one here. So just turn it until those two are lined up. I'll try to get my big head out of the way so you can see it. Okay, and once that happens, you're able to just thread the line straight through. I'm sorry, I went through the back end first. Yeah. I know that because they've got this nice little line in indicator for me. And then it'll come out the other end. Try not to drop it. And then just run your line so that they're equal. Obviously I've got a short line on here so you can see it. And then once you've got that, you just wind it in. So real, real simple line change on this. And of course, you're not taking this apart. You're not winding both sides in there. That's the biggest pain point for most string trimmers. And then it's a bump feed head. So, you know, obviously I've got this a little short. It's not quite reaching out of the cutter. They're actually not quite even yet. So just kick it on and bump it out and you're ready to go. Now, price on this is pretty solid. With a two amp hour battery and a charger, you're looking at $189. You can find this at Lowe's. If you got any questions about it, feel free to ask them in the comments below. I'll do my best to answer them for you. I'm Kenny. As always, thanks for watching. Hey, help us out by subscribing to the channel below and tap that bell to get notified when we post new tool reviews and shootouts. And as always, thanks for watching.